Our card for today and the thing to focus on when you're pulling in higher frequency angelic messaging, okay, we have mountain. The number is six. Now, things around angels have become incredibly trendy. I made a whole video about this stuff. If you want to ask me questions, you want my opinion on it, let me know in the comments and I will make further videos on that. But we want to be careful with falling in love with the idea of something like angel numbers. Don't make it trendy because when you make it trendy, you're not connecting to it. The reason why I'm saying that, we have the number six on this card and the card is mountain. Now, six with angelic numbering is the material world. It's material manifestation. Mountain is needing, in my mind, to stand strong, to be steady, to be able to weather any storm. Mountains survive fire. And this feels like, I just heard the hidden place. The hidden place. So, something is going to be coming up that may challenge you to look at your material existence. It's not inviting you to get worried about money. It's not inviting you to complain about your job. It's not inviting you to, you know, neglect your health. You know what I'm saying? And be like, oh, well, spirituality will fix everything. It's also not inviting you to be overly obsessed with something that you think is wrong, whatever it is, whatever area of life. This is telling you to stand strong. And I'm even hearing stand still, <laughs> to stand still so that you can experience truth. Truth, they're saying, uh, has no words. It has no image. It just is. It's an experience. Now, through the very act of experiencing, there could be feelings with it. Rays of color. <laughs> now that's a visual, but they're, they're bringing that through that some people might experience. Um, maybe not the visions of color, but the frequency of color. I know it's a little hard to understand, isn't it? I'm, I'm having a hard time with that myself. But again, it's going beyond the senses and, and realizing, I don't want to give you like a trope here. I don't want to say, and then you're realizing your strength and you're being strong like the mountain. It's not that. <laughs> it's, I mean, it's sort of that, but not really. This is... Stepping beyond what you think you know and being willing to be vulnerable so that you can take in new information and have new spiritual experiences that are pure, that are not just willy-nilly like opening your energy field and letting any old thing come in just for the thrill and the sting of the unknown. Does, does that make sense? Uh, so be careful with this. There is something coming up that you're going to have to be very strong about. Try not to be too egotistical about it, okay? So we're going to leave it there before we make this even more overly complicated. I am sending you all so much love and take care.